So I recently closed on my first flip and in the last video I talked about how I got the flip, how I funded the flip, and how I found my partner for the flip. But in this episode I wanted to give you guys a full on tour before we even start the renovation so you guys can kind of see a before and after once it's fully completed. So with that being said make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up, go subscribe if you're not subscribed, like literally like, guys what are you doing? Go click that subscribe button so you guys never miss an upload, turn that bell notification on, and with that being said let's head over and go see this flip all right guys so I just got in here the lights are off so it's a bit dark but um I'm gonna turn the lights on and then I'll get back to you guys all right guys so I'm back and I just turned on all the lights um, some of them the light fixtures they're just not working at the moment but I'm gonna flip the camera around give you guys a house tour um, but this is the front door so right when you walk in you have your closet to your right and this is where the seller was telling me about like the mold so if you guys didn't see my previous video i did talk about like what this property had which was mold and what we're going to be doing to it um but it did have some mold and it wasn't a huge amount but it was enough that the seller just wanted to be out of it but it may be hard to see on the camera um but yeah right when you walk in you have your living room you have a fireplace and this living room is actually pretty pretty big built in you know bookcase whatever you want to use this for storage stuff over here you have your dining room all these light fixtures are going to be replaced the flooring is going to be all um, redone the whole uh, condo here is going to be painted so right when you walk through the hallway to your right you have the kitchen and the crazy thing is like these are literally new appliances that she left so we have those which is awesome um, we're going to keep this even though it may look a bit older with this development here um, the property that the other properties that have been recently sold our cabinets are way better than what their cabinets are and the ARV is actually like really good where it's at um, so it's like no reason for us to um, get new cabinets I mean they're soft clothes too so everyone likes everyone likes soft clothes cabinets um, but yeah this is the kitchen uh, you go upstairs right here and then to your left you have the garage over here you got the hot water heater and you can see there was some some water damage over here so we want to make sure we check on that she did say that was a while um, let it focus here it happened a while back but those stains just stayed there um, but yeah and in here we're thinking of putting some vinyl we may just be keeping that floor, uh, that rug there, just change it, change the color. Over here, you got the washer and dryer she left. Gonna make this vinyl as well, since there are uh, drains over here and in that one over there. But with these floors, we're gonna put LVP in, so it's gonna look really nice. Over here, you have the first bathroom so it's not too bad but um, we're gonna make it look really good here you got closet for your towels or blankets whatever you want to use it for and then you have your first bedroom so this house is two bedrooms and two full baths which is a pretty decent sized room and the closets are pretty big as well and as you guys can see there's mold in here 
Um, it may be hard to see on the camera, but there's lots of moisture within the closets. So we're gonna make sure that is all, all dealt with. But you come out here and you turn into the main, the main bedroom, the master, the primary, whatever you wanna call it. And then here is this bathroom. So this one, the flooring, we're probably just gonna leave because it's gonna be really expensive just to get this one up. And it's it's really nice. I mean, like there's no reason why we would wanna um, replace that. So this bathroom is pretty, you know, it's a good size, pretty good size. And then you come over here to the walk-in closet. So there's moisture in it as well. That's why she told me she was hanging these bags up. Um, so we'll make sure we deal with all of that. All the water damage, all the, the mold, all that stuff that this property has. And you guys can see over here, there's a lot of stuff on that uh, molding right there. And then the wall's orange, so everything's going to get repainted. But that is it. So this is a condo. So we just own everything inside. There is an HOA fee of 180 per month. So we do have to take that into consideration when we are putting our holding costs together since with this property, we're thinking it may, you know, we may have it for, let's say three, four months max, just because it's a really light, I mean, it's not super bad with the rehab, but about a light rehab. A lot of people like to say it's a wholesale deal because like literally if it didn't have mold, this property could be on the market like that. And it's, it's a really nice, <laughs> really nice property here. Really nice property. Um, but yeah, that's basically it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, actually, wait, wait, I completely forgot about this part. There's a sunroom. I don't know how I forgot about that. But yeah, let's go out here so you guys can see. There's a sunroom and it actually wraps around, which is pretty cool. And it's beautiful out. But that, that's it. <laughs> um, but yeah, so uh, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode of the house tour. I'm gonna be filming more content surrounding this whole flip because I'm just super excited and I wanna document the journey, share it with you guys so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing through this first flip. Um, you know, I'm definitely learning a lot from my mentor um, working on this flip with me and I'm just super excited because this, you know, this is a major step. This is the first step to many more flips coming down the road. Uh, but yeah, with that being said, make sure you guys give this video a thumbs up. Go subscribe if you're not subscribed. Turn that bell button on so you guys never miss an upload. And go follow me on Instagram so you guys can get behind the scenes footage of what I'm doing. But with that being said, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.